Today we're going to be talking about color theory. We're going to look at the order of the colors on the color wheel. What are warm and cool colors, analogous colors? What does value look like? What are complementary colors? The first thing I want you to do is put your name and your teacher's name at the top of this paper with a pencil. Now let's get a red oil pastel from our tray. You may have to share the colors as we go. Um, sometimes the trays get mixed up and they're just what is one of each. We're going to color our color wheel in rainbow order. So Roy G. Biv, whom we just saw on the video, that is the order we're going to go in. So the next color that we're going to color is orange. And we're going to continue to color our color wheel all the way around using our very best coloring skills. Now you do it. Here it doesn't matter which color blue you use, you can decide. Same way with the violet in the next um, little section of our color wheel, you can use any color purple you like. Now we're going to color the Roy G. Biv that you see there on the side. I'm going to put red, well, I was going to write red and then I changed my mind. I'm going to just color that R with a red. I'll know that's red. I don't need to write it out because orange isn't going to fit in that little tiny box. So we're going to just color each of those letters with the color that they represent. Now you do it. put those colors in cool and warm families. So which colors do you think go in the cool section? You're right, those bottom colors are the ones that are going to fit in that cool family. 
So I'm just going to make some little dots with those colors in that cool family box. Now you do it. Now I'm going to do the same thing in the warm family box. I'm going to put my three warm colors in that box. Just some polka dots. We'll be fine. Now you do it. Now complementary colors are colors that are opposite of each other on the color wheel. And while I was doing this worksheet, I discovered something very interesting that I'd never thought about before. Complementary colors come from two different families. So like red and green are opposite each other on the color wheel, they are also in opposite families. So red is a warm color and green is a cool color. And as you go around the color wheel, you're going to discover that all the complementary colors come from two different families. Now you do it. talk about analogous colors and we kind of touched on analogous colors the last time um, our last lesson when we were talking about lines and we were talking about painting um, so analogous colors are next-door neighbors on the color wheel so I'm going to use a red and an orange a yellow and green and a blue and a violet Now you do it. To do a value scale, I'm going to put just a little bit of white on one end. That's going to be my lightest end. And I'm going to put a teeny tiny bit of black. Remember, black is a very bossy color. So we don't want a lot of black on this end. But that's going to be my darkest value. And I haven't really used a pink, so I thought, I'm going to use pink. My pink's feeling a little bit of left out. so. I'm going to color my value scale from lightest to darkest and you'll see it start to get darker and mix with that, that black and kind of make a weird gray. My white kind of got covered up so I'm going to have to add a little bit more white to make it lighter on the end but that is our value scale. 
now you do it. So that is our color theory lesson. It's just a one day lesson real quick just to get you a good idea of the order of colors on the color wheel and what are complementary and analogous colors, what are warm and cool colors. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for playing along with me today. 